fashion category. Yes, sir. Come to our second bout of the evening, and it is the most violent, most dangerous combat sport on the planet. No joke, more people die in white collar boxing than any other combat sport. Why? Probably because they do a bunch of coke before they get to the fucking ring. Idiots. Idiots, I tell you. So without further ado, this is boardroom brawling, and it is three two-minute rounds, three two-minute rounds of action. First, fighting out of the blue corner. The blue corner hails from the UK, and he looks about 12 years old. His yacht length is 18 meter, and his fight name is fucking Nebraska. What is his specialty? Meeting bingo. Meeting bingo. Let's give it up for the blue corner, Denver Jackson. His opponent, standing across the squared circle, wearing the tailor-made outfit. This man also hails from the UK and is slightly over the hill in age. His yacht length is 20 meters and he is a sugar daddy. What is his specialty? Accidental ball strikes. Let's give it up for the UK's own David Armitage. <laughs> this fight, because both of these men are so wealthy, they will be prize fighting tonight. That's right, no purse on the line, they will be prize fighting. Three two minute rounds of boardroom brawling. And when it gets under the way, the man in charge is Matthew Semper. Once, once again, purple gloves, David Armitage. And in the red gloves, Denver Jackson, three two minute rounds. Third man in the ring. Uh, Tiger Muay Thai legend Matt Semper. Like he's an, honestly like a serious official. Oh, okay. taking control of the ring. Yeah, he doesn't fuck around. According to a recent Pew Research poll, this is the fastest growing combat sport on the planet, Teddy. Yes, it is. Absolutely. We're going to see a bunch of those here. Take a look <clears throat> at the corner. We got the norm corner there. All right. Jackson with the jabs, pawing at him. Big right hand by Jackson. Oh, Armitage trying to bully him. Oh, another right hand. Jackson will not back down. He's getting pushed, but he is pushing back. Oh, good right hand from Armitage. Goes to the body, both of them now. Not a lot of defense here from either of these guys. They're just kind of going forward. They only go forward. No, this is a full-blown brawl right here. And see what I'm saying? They, I, don't, I don't think they actually like each other. These are two of the richest men in Thailand, finally getting it out. Getting... Oh, oh, oh. David Armitage doesn't blink. Yeah, no. I think we know why David Armitage has those big eyes. We know what he's been doing backstage. <laughs> yeah, I believe you're right. We try to, oh. uh, you know, do nose inspections, but these guys are crafty. Wow, oh, Jackson was actually pushing him back. Nice little cheeky uppercut there from Jack. Yeah, I think he realized standing and, standing and banging with a bigger Armitage was like a really bad idea. That gut, though, is weighing on Armitage now. Sure. It might look good in the boardroom, but uh, it's getting heavy, that tire. Carrying around a few extra kilos, as, oh. as they say over here. Kilos. For my Oof. American audience, it's like two and a half <laughs> pounds or something. Look at the smarty pants. Jackson going for the kill, but couldn't get it. Pawing now, Armitage. Mouth wide open. He's exhausted already. Jackson's looking pretty, pretty fresh, though. Yeah, he's sure. already got a mouse, though, under his left eye. I'm sure his head's ringing a little bit. You know, Absolutely. You know, first minute was a real bad idea. Five seconds left here in the first round. Great straight right sneaking through there from Armitage. I'm not sure if you caught that. Oh, yeah. Wow. Beautiful. First round Beautiful. in the books. Now that's End a, of round one. Mojo team. More than living up to the billing here. Yeah. I mean, they both went after it. They did what they could. These are not skilled boxers. These are skilled businessmen. Oh, we're losing the pants. Armitage is taking his pants off, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, overheating. See? Yep. Definitely cocaine. His balls are hot, I think. Well, yeah, they've been wearing three-piece three three suits all day. Yes. The ring, the ring girls. Without them, who the fuck knows what round we've been? Nobody here can count. 
She is very pretty. So Armitage's corner man there is a guy named Mark, I believe. Okay. From, uh, I think he joins a top team. And if you can see the y yellow suited little little Asian man, Chris Carlo Chua, he brought along his friend and didn't tell him where they were going. <laughs> and we keep throwing him into stuff. He's, he's involved in more throughout the car. More naked, I love it. Naked boardroom action. <clears throat> and like, what a perfect name for, for the guy who's like being hoodwinked, Mark. Mark. Like we have a we have an yep. actual mark in the crowd tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Round two. Pants off, shirt open. Let's go. Round two of white collar boxing. Purple gloves, Armitage. Red gloves, Jackson. These guys are arrogant, rich assholes who think they win at everything. But someone's going home a loser. Yeah, I'm guessing they got bored comparing like. Fucking yes. Bank account, dick size, boat size, and they were like, let's let's slug it out. And I'm honestly impressed. This is a great little matchup here. It's tight. It's how you handle your skirmishes. Put on some gloves and get in the ring. Like how Jackson's kind of kind of moving his head, getting some head movement in there. Good right hand. Still has that mouse under his eye though, Jackson. Armitage tired as shit, but looking all right face wise. Nice right hand there from the big guy. Got himself out of the norm corner. There he is. Yeah. He didn't allow himself to be bullied by the smaller man. He should be leaning on him. I know that they don't, they're not trained, but Armitage could get him in the corner, start leaning on him, get that belly on him. Sure, a little dirty boxing action exactly. would probably favor Armitage. It certainly did in the first minute of the fight. But he was taking a lot of uh, ice ice water baths in the corner there. It's pretty uh, Here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Ever. 30 seconds here, round two. Three two-minute rounds for these two. Oh, now he's going for it. Nah, didn't have it in him. Good left hook from the big man. Heavy breathing right now from, <laughs> yes, from Big Dave. Yes. I don't know if Jackson's got the muscle power to take him down. That, there's that right hand from Jax. Yeah. Oh, but he gets tagged on the way out. Oh, left hand from the big guy. Oh, he might have hurt Jackson. They are brawling. Armitage showing some halfway decent skills for a guy I'm, yeah. I'm told doesn't train. Yeah. Um, amazing. And I know they're catching some of it here on the stream, but this Illusion nightclub is phenomenal. This is like made for fight circus. Look at, look at Denver Jackson. He's actually maybe second thoughts now after the second round. Are they going to disrobe <laughs> anymore? <laughs> I hope so. Third round is nude, so don't go anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> don't go anywhere, ladies. Ring girls, how would we know what round it was without smoking hot chicks? Yeah, she's hot. All right. I mean, it's been a mess the first two rounds, as you expect from people who do not train. Jackson, though, seems as though he... Maybe, you know, after work, you know, hits mitts every once in a while. Yeah. Oh, actually, who do you have up right now on the card, sir? Ooh, that's very interesting. We'll probably see a judge's decision. Seconds uh, out and seconds away. As everybody knows, I, I more than occasionally do judge professional bouts. And 100%. Yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna give, the, uh, give it to Armitage at this point. Damage. I am too. He's doing more damage. Yes, sir. Oh! I think Jackson knows he's got to prove it right now. Otherwise, he's going to go home with his tail between his legs. Both of these guys could benefit from getting on the Gorilla Supplements. Absolutely. Saying, you know? I, I think they will after this. Good right uh, uppercut there from Arbitage. The big guy throwing the paws. Good head movement, Good head movement there from oh. the little man. Walked into a jab, though, and that hurt him. Might be good for Hermitage to just run away at this point, which he is. A little smart strategy. He might have paid his cornerman very well. They can both be very proud of what they've brought to this card, you know. Like that hook Jack's trying to throw. He hasn't landed it for shit, but I like that he's trying. There's that right hand. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Send him center stage. Wow, Jackson, exhausted. Armitage seems like he has a second wind. Oh, big right hand from Jackson. May have wobbled. Come on, 48 seconds. Someone's got to drop. A lot of mouth breathing here. I Let's think go. Both of these guys are, uh, tank is empty at this point almost. Running on fumes. 
looks easy until you step in the ring when you're under the big lights and the crowd is yelling your name. Get that uppercut, can't do it, good defense, Armitage. A rare shot to the body there. <laughs> yeah. A lot of head hunting. Again, back to my theory, these guys hate each other's guts. Those red gloves are heavy. Oh, good left hand from Armitage. Holy shit. Yeah, that was a nice uh, left hook, actually. They're digging deep, these two. Giving it all they got. You gotta love it. The mouthpiece is coming out of Jackson. Oh, no, he might not even last. Final seconds of the final round. David Armitage, Denver, Jackson, giving it their all, and that is it. I did not think we were going to need the judges, but surprisingly, we do. Valiant effort from both of these guys. They are half dead in the corner. They're going to have, they're going to be visibly have been in a boxing match. By the time you see them tomorrow, yeah, 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 they're not going to be able to pull this off at the office. Like, no, you go no, in no. Monday morning, we're going to be like, uh, what happened to you? Be a little bit of a fight club action there. Going to the office with your face smashed up. Yeah, uh, Jackson's got a nice shiner on his right eye. I expect to see these guys uh, crushing a little bit of Bangkok vodka and tonics after this. Couldn't do this without the sponsors, ladies and gentlemen. Support those that support the sport. Wow. It's like a poem. Did you write that before you got no, on? Top of the dome. Top of the dome. That's why you get paid the big bucks, sir. We switched seats and I forgot to bring my notes up here, so I'm gonna grab them. I'm gonna grab them as the next fight. <laughs> tighten this shit up a little bit. That's it, fight circus. This is why white collar boxing is the most dangerous combat sport in the world. I said, how you doing, Dave? He said, heart attack. See what I mean? See what I mean? Denver, are you okay? Can you guys actually make it? You okay? All right. Referee, please bring them in. I'll get on it. Yeah, we weren't lying about how dangerous the sport actually is. It's typically unconditioned athletes, you know, really going after it. David Armitage is having a tough time making it out of his corner. Gotta get those gloves off of that man. He is overheating. That was great. I wasn't sure about this one, but once I saw the training montages from both of these dudes, I was like, oh, they're capable of... Uh, Putting a grown man on, on his ass with a blow or two, appropriately located. Matt Semper in there. We're about to get the judge's decision. We actually flew in very I serious judges for this event. What you guys in the room are thinking was, wow, pugilism at its finest. Am I right? Lomachenko, Triple G, eat your freaking heart out. These guys do not have any actual training, believe it or not. Again, no losers in this dojo, but one of these billionaires has to take the L. So after three two-minute rounds of boardroom brawl action, our judges have come to a unanimous decision for your red corner, David Armitage. He's not even shaking the hand. Just blowing that fucker off. Cold shoulder from David Armitage. Great job. Now again, this is prize fighting. I could not get you a belt. You got so many Gucci ones. I could not get you a trophy. The cups you have are priceless. So here is what I have for you. You see my little man over here? You see my little man? That right there is from the bathroom in my foyer. It is literally from the bathroom in my house. It is a crystal Swarovski super, uh, it, right? So you can either have that chandelier or what's in the mystery box? You cannot have one of the doors, slavery is illegal. Do you want what's in the box or do you want what's in there? What do you guys think? What's in the box or what do you think? What's in the box? What do you want? Let's go for the mystery box. Let's go for the mystery box. Batman, lift the box up. Lift the box up. Show him what he's won. Lift it up. Nothing. There's nothing in it. You're stupid. You're so fucking stupid. <laughs>